Oh, it's not nice. There we are again. You know, I always forget this. Uh, there are a lot of newcomers coming in, and I always think you know it all. You, you, you are with me for 17 years, and I forget I should talk about all the beginning, and maybe today we will do it. Start off with the canvas. We have our mighty canvas here. It's white. I put the magic white on. You know, the magic white uh, is kind of a paint what's related to the oil paint, and it dries slow because it, it should not be dry when you are paint, when you do the, the work, when you put the colors on there. So maybe start off from there. Now you see a white canvas, and I want to start. How the devil you start? You got to find what, what do I paint, what I want to do. I got to be ready in my mind with what I want to put on there. See, everything we do is not a copy. It's easy when you, maybe it is not even easy when you have a book or a postcard and you <coughs> copy something. See, what we are doing, we create. We are the almighty creators. We are next to God. And uh, we put something on what's done once at a time. It never will come back again. You, will, you never will do the same thing. Because it, my, sometimes it is similar, but it is not the same. With other words, you come free onto your canvas. You put up your sleeves and you are fresh. You have to make yourself happy. Even if you're miserable when you had breakfast, you say, on my canvas, I am free and I'm powerful and I'm the creator. Or you say, I'm the almighty creator. I start the almighty day. And when you start that almighty day, you hear the bells ringing. You hear, you see, there's sunshine. Even if it rains, you feel there's sunshine out there. And kids are laughing and, and everything is bubbling and all that. With all this happy feeling, you go onto your almighty canvas. And then you can do almighty things. <clears throat> See, now, first, having the canvas, how big? Sometimes you have a long canvas, high up, uh, vertical, or uh, flat. This way I have it, uh, you know, any, any good old way. You got to space it first. You must think, I want to paint something that would fit there and what has rhyme, rhythm, harmony. How the devil I get it all in? Okay, today we will have a happy blue sky. <clears throat> then we will have a mountain coming in from the side. Then we will have a mighty tree here. Then we will have maybe a little house here, a little old farm, and, but you put it all together, you good old why. And then we will have big fences maybe around. And I will go into stones, lots of big stones, <coughs> like, <coughs> excuse me, like a little desert scene. Okay, let's fire in. Put that almighty sky on, that almighty blue sky on. There are so many blues. This is kind of a happy blue, Taylor blue, kind of a happy blue. <coughs> excuse me. And rub it in. Rub it in hard. Don't light in f loose. Rub it in hard. Don't put too much on. See, and then you get it all oh, this, so oh, this, this, uh, this. Uh, you create a. Can you see? I create a distance. Uh, uh, it looks like it's a deep sky. The sky is not hanging down like a curtain. See, all that we have to watch. Okay. Again, a bit more blue on top. If I want to have it more, more deep, then make it more blue on top and, and let it feather out, feather out, feather out. And you see it getting, getting lighter, 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 lighter. You create almighty illusion. <clears throat> see, it's wrong to paint the sky hanging down like a curtain. Then you have no depth. You cannot paint a mountain far away. You cannot bring things in. See, all that has to be with you. And I just like to talk about it today. <clears throat> Good. Now, if you want, you can put a kind of a reddish tune in. It depends on whatever you have a dream. I will show you. Maybe we can do it just to give you a rough idea what can be done. <clears throat> See, I will add a little, little touch of red. See, look at that. You must think the canvas is wet. 
See, it gives you a right away a different tune. See, you can have a kind of a happy uh, uh, ye yellow, but, but yellow, yellow and blue is always a kind of a headache. See, but this, this is a nice, gives you a nice depth. It's a nice deep sky right now. <clears throat> okay, I take my almighty knife and I put some white over here and I use black, uh, blue, <coughs> And alizarin crimson, those colors are the best for mountain. See, and I mix it so that it's not dead. To depends on how far I want. I want that mountain quite close behind that house. Maybe I keep it in that dark, dark kind of a mountain like this. And I will come in right from far up there. See. Oh, maybe like this. That's right behind behind that house. You must think a little happy little farm, but the farm is neglected, and no one is there anymore. See, it would be nice if I had more time. When you have more time, you can put people in, you can put life in, and whatever, whatever. But then here, very often I get mail, people ask me, is it all you can do, landscapes? And yeah, I wish I could. I could. I, if they give me a bit more time, it is them. It's not awful. Phone in and give them hell. <laughs> Tell them, give him an hour, and then he will show us. OK, <clears throat> good. So we, we say this, this is the beginning of, of that bit of a farm I want there. I would say the light is coming from this side. So we will fire in with some white. Touch of little touch of red into that kind of a touch of Indian yellow. See how I take it off? No, I got a nice sunshine color here. Good, and we will we will see. look at look at look at oh God! Isn't that something? See that paint breaks. Try to find the paint what is thick and strong. And it's not uh, it is soupy paint. Forget it. You can you can do nothing with it. See this here. That makes it really, really nice. Look how that start coming to life. You know, very, f very easy. The same colors like the sun would hit there. There. Maybe here a little bit. You create like the stone formations and the whatever whatever you think that is all right. See, that's the way it looks. Now we put it up there. And then you, you just go with the shape of your mountains. You think the water is running down for thousands of years and just follow the trail of that water and you never, you never will be wrong. See, look, just follow the, the swing of your almighty mountain. There we are. See, maybe here a little bit. So put, bring it to life. That's good enough. I won't worry too much. Now I will use my two inch brush and I will use sap green and black and a part of this mountain color here. The all dust I bring together black and that mountain color and I want to create almighty as a, oh God, there's this almighty tree there. It is not a, 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 a fir tree. It is a kind of a, see, look. See how I do it? There you are. See? Maybe here. Can you see? The, maybe I have to show you that better. See, when I take my paint, I take the paint off here and there. Can you see, can you see, it's a ton of paint. Can I have a close-up shot on that brush? 
will be really, you can see all the branches and leaves in my brush already. See? And then you just leave openings and fire it in, which why you, your eyes, maybe there's a little bit, there's a little bit, here out and there out. See, look at that. Isn't it wonderful how you can create a, a almighty, almighty tree there <coughs> with all the, with all the grouts, see here you can have branch, uh, branches flying down. Can see, could you make a close-up shot on this here? How you? It depends on how, uh, which way I hit. See, if I hit this way, watch, then I get gets it up. See, it's standing up. See, if I hit this way, it will come down. <coughs> Good. See how easy you. Firing things and, and, and load your thoughts. Maybe here's the other one. It's all loose and free. And you see the birds going through and the, the wind is going through. It's a beautiful, beautiful. Uh, look at that. See how loose it is? And leave openings, leave openings. See, as you come down here, then, as you come down here against that mountain too, see, look at that. So you create, I close up more. I, I want the dark there. I want the dark there. See how nice you live with smile, with the almighty smile, and you create such a wonderful, it's a wonderful day. Oh, that is so wonderful to be alive. And uh, that's what that's what painting is all about. See, you just add a little bit whatever you think. I want to have it coming up lighter, lighter. But on the bottom, I want to have it dark here, dark there, see there, dark here. <coughs> see, maybe here we fire up something there. See, now we are in good shape, good start. Now I will use my almighty knife and I will cut in a tree trunk there. See, branches. See, cut in branches, whatever you think. See, here. Isn't that wonderful? Oh, you can fire up if you want. Look at that. Fire up, fire down. Make it so that it's wider on the bottom. See, as, as I go down, I, I twist my knife. That blade becomes wider, wider, and pulls more. See? Isn't that wonderful? It's nice to have that flow. It is hard when you stutter, when you don't know where I put the next brush on or the next step. It's nice just flow it off, roll it off until whew, you're finished. And there's a beautiful painting left. And you was the almighty creator. You had, you had the control. You was the power. You was, you was <clears throat> there's something to it, really. I think that's born into all of us to, to say that was me, I did it. See here, I try to add a little bit on that stem, on the bottom, I want to see, walk up a little bit. See, isn't that wonderful? Here, maybe. So you create your own little happy world, and that is good living. <clears throat> Art should be fun. We should laugh it off. And when you go to the bank, you must be happy there too. You know you have your bread and butter. You don't have to worry about paying your, your mortgage or your bills. And that should all come out of that almighty creative power what you have. See here, I would put a little bit of a tree trunk in with the knife. And look at that. 
maybe we make it double, double or nothing. Yeah, once you show there the power of <coughs> whatever here. Sometimes upstrokes, they are easier. See, then now the next step is you use the other little one inch brush and you go into the white. We have two types of white. It's a heavier, it's a thick white and a thin white. And I use some yellow, yellow, and even Indian yellow into that too. And we, again, lots of paint on. Can you see if you have a close up here? There's all the, the, the leaves and they, they're all in there already. Now, light is coming from that side. Look at that. Isn't it nice how fast you get life into that tree and leave a lot of openings? I always come down from the top, from the top down, because see the paint, the, the dark, can you see the, the dirt goes into your brush? And, but I want to have a little bit of dirt in there now, because a little bit of bright was too bright. That gives me nice color maybe here. See, look at that. That's beautiful. In no time, you have see, clean off that brush here and load the brush again. And that brush is loaded. See, fire off here again where the sun is coming the brightest. Can you see some pattern up there? The one hit and the other hit most, looks most the same. Sometimes it's good to change the brush, the side of the brush. See, I changed over to this side. Now I hope it has a different, yeah, see, look. Do you see, if one side don't give you the right pattern, turn it around and go over the other side. There are two sides of the brushes, and you get the other pattern there. See? Look, it's, it's still the same pattern, but I can accept it. I like that. See, there you are. Beautiful, beautiful. Now we will, we will cut in a happy little shack there. Oh, we see, I space it in my mind. Uh, uh, flat like that. See, flat like that. And then I use that gray mountain gray there, but I have it a bit white, and it gives me a nice uh, nice uh, wood color there in front, you see? And then you, 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 you. Put the kind of a, a rim on that the roof there, <coughs> see, that's underneath. Uh, if you want, you can run a little bit of uh, wood lines in there. See, gives you that little extra there. Makes a lot of fun too. And then you, 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 you. Here, I will have it with dark and let it go in there. <coughs> and then I fire off a roof, maybe red, Indian yellow, and white, kind of a different color there. And make it so this is a slather, different colors right on the knife. And then you push it in like this. See, in no time, you got that roof up there already. And it's still big fun. You laugh it off. Sometimes I go this way. See, I pull it this way. If you want to, then if you want to, do it your own good or why. That's the best. As long as everything has gone your way. See here, I put a little bit of stuff on the roof. And then we go underneath. <coughs> See, like that. And here, we let it disappear in, in yonder. I will have a touch of uh, uh, 
blue stretch there. Here, this just. See, let it be very loose there. It gives you that feeling of you have a, uh, you have a, uh, here we put a door in, maybe on this side. There's a door. See, look at that. Uh, you can have a scratch it on the side. This way you look in this way, you can have a in, or you can use a touch of uh, colors there, see, gives you that too. Then you can have a little bit of a bluish tune here. Then it is a window there. It's a window there. See? No, you, you, you. You think, we will think, no, all of a sudden there is a, a cement cement wall, see, look, and it's all going in front, just heavy, heavy, heavy stones, stones lying there. See how you get the stones together, all that gray. See? All that gray, white, and black, and green, and blue, all together. See, mix it all together. Whatever comes out is good stone color. Look, it's all stone color. Can we see? Look at that. Then you highlight that. You use white and yellow. See, and highlight that, you have the sun coming from there. See, now we will, we will not forget, not forget. I go too fast, I need kind of a rim there. It's not good enough, so I have to do it better. See. See? And if it is too big, look what you do, like this. There's no problem. You never, you never make a mistake. You always can take it off and make it your way. See? Look at that. <coughs> See? There you are. Maybe here I would like to have a little bit of a bluish tune. Just colors, just colors there. See? Okay. <coughs> See here, here now, we will, we will give him that little bit of sunshine on top of that stone wall there. See, comes good together, isn't it? Look here, you just. There you are. And you can work fast, you have fun. Make it so this, you, this, this stones there. You then you pile the stones up once at a time. And that is it's hard to, uh, you can count the stones. You just act like you think they're all stones. <clears throat> See, now here in front, I will, I will create a kind of a happy, the happy little, uh, see? It's happy little front there, with kind of a, like sand or whatever there is. And you come out here, see, you come out here, come out here. And again, all that dark here. See? Boy, I got to rush. But that's what you do. Just don't, if you paint, enjoy it. Do it powerful with all your heart. And you enjoy it. And that's where we really get the painting done right. 
He made his son hits here a little bit, here a little bit. See, you can see that. And then here we just put the put the the front end, the foreground in, and in no time, see, watch, in no time. You got the interesting painting there. And every time you do it, it is always something new. See? It's always something new. Yeah. Now, then you can put figures in. If I had more time, you could f put figures in or have kids flying in front or have animals walking around there and whatever you, that is, this is, I wish, this is what I, I was like to, to tell you, phone in and tell him, this guy needs a bit more time. You kill him. They kill me. And I know we are friends. You wouldn't let them kill me. <clears throat> It would be nice, really, that we could start the whole show paying along with Bill, where we all just get the easels up, and then I could be slower, and I could really get you step by step. And, oh, we would be happy, I tell you. We would be so happy. But look, we are happy still, isn't it? Isn't that wonderful? We did it. We did it. We did it. Now I put just a couple extra hits in here. Just give him a little bit of extra there, and maybe here, and maybe here. There we are, and we did it. You enjoyed it? I thank you for watching me. Bye-bye.